Hey, this is Jeff Loomis from the Jeff Loomis Band, and you're watching Groovy TV. Hey, this is Groovy. I'm here with Jeff Loomis here at the Gothic Theater, Denver, Colorado. How's it going, man? It's going great, bro. Right on. Awesome. Great to be here. What a wicked awesome tour this is, man. <laughs> It's kind of crazy, yeah. It's like uh, 57 dates with uh, two days off, so Crap. it's pretty uh, massive. As the as the tour was like uh, just starting, I, I I've never done a tour like this before. That you know, so many dates in a row, but uh, it's making it go by very very quickly. <laughs> that's for sure. How have the crowds been so far? Awesome, man. Yeah. Awesome, yeah. Every show's been been killer. You know, um, I think it's like a, a pretty diverse lineup as far mm -hmm. as bands go. So the crowd is going to be. Uh, very pleased with, with what they hear. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. Like this town loves you and loves soil work. So I would imagine, I'd imagine this is gonna sell out if it hasn't. Oh man, you know, I've had so many memories of playing here in the past, you know, the Bluebird Theater, the Ogden, mm -hmm. um, with Nevermore. And oh, it's yeah. always been really cool shows. So I'm sure tonight's gonna be just as great. Right on. Yeah. Now, um, heard you're putting a new album together? Um, I, there's a talks right now of me and Keith Merrow possibly okay. putting a, a project together. Um, and that would probably be sometime, of course, after this tour is over with. We'd probably write and uh, record over the summertime and hopefully release it sometime in the fall. Okay. So that's kind of what I, we're looking at right now. No, uh, you're probably going to take a long break after this tour, but any other tours planned? Um, not really, no. No, I've already toured like five times on this record, so it's time for a break. Give the yeah. old, give the ears a rest, you know? <laughs> <laughs> take a nap or two. Yeah, yeah. play with my cats. <laughs> we be glad to see you. Yeah. Now, sort of dropped the ball on NAMM. We didn't talk, we didn't do a lot of tech talk at NAMM, so mm -hmm. I wanted to catch up, you know. We're getting there, folks. We're getting there. Mm -hmm. So, like, you know, what are you using these days and, you know, let me, let me know all the tech stuff. Well, I mean, I was, I was using Engel amplifiers for a very, very long time, but I'm kind of in a tone searching thing right now. You know, as every artist does, you know, they play gear for quite a while, but then they search for something new. So I'm messing around right now with the new Kemper profiling amp, which is really, really cool. Um, anybody that wants to know more about that can obviously, you know, Google Kemper profiling amps or um, check out a video that I did on YouTube. I did a, a video of a cover song from Jason Becker called Perpetual Burn. Okay. And you can check that out, and I'm using the Kemper on that. Um, as far as guitars, I've been using my, my signature guitars from mm -hmm. Schechter mm -hmm. for a very long time now. Um, great guitar, very affordable for the seven string guitars that wants, right. wants a new piece of gear. Um, that's really about it, man. Dunlop okay. guitar picks, Ernie Ball guitar strings. Uh, I really keep it pretty simple when it comes that's to about us. Yeah, the tone comes from the fingers, man. <laughs> yeah. Do you use anything different, say, the recording or touring or? Uh, you know, I, when it comes to recording, it can be a complete different ball game. You know, because you're really, you know, you you want to get different tones. So obviously, you're you're welcome to use different kinds of gear. So right. I've been known to use a bunch of different stuff in the studio just okay. to get certain tones. You know, so. I like to play around with that stuff. That's about us. Now, uh, outside of music, what do you geek out on? Uh, Walking Dead. <laughs> yes. The Walking Dead. <laughs> we actually have a pretty cool shirt that, that we're selling on this tour called The Walking Shred. <laughs> so it's kind of like our little, uh, you know, our little uh, wave to, the, to that show saying how much we enjoy it. But um, yeah, it's, um, it's a pretty simple thing, really. I'm a normal guy that likes to do normal things. You know, I read a lot. Mm -hmm. um, I, uh, I like to cook, you know, spend time with my family at home. That's, you know, that's about it, you know, but right most of the times, 90% of the time, it's always do, doing music things. Sure. So sure. that's what I do, you know, I'm a musician, so. And you're very, very successful at it. Thank you, man. <laughs> Thank you, I try. <laughs> I'm gonna write some wicked tunes. All right, Manuel, you know, you, you've dealt with us a few times before, so you know, we gotta ask you at least one stupid question. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> I was waiting for this. <laughs> well, these are the guys that ask the stupid questions. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not. Did we do the food one last? We did do the food one. I'll let I'll let Matthew I'll, I'll let Matthew choose actually. Go ahead. Let's give them the math one. The math question. Are you ready? I failed miserably in math in like <laughs> school. So, all right. Okay. Between one and one hundred, mm -hmm. how many times does the number nine appear? Uh, nine. What? Oh, no, I, I see. More. <laughs> Dude, I'm an idiot, man. <laughs> I've got blonde hair, man. <laughs> blonde moment. Yeah. Okay, more than um, uh, 20? Yes! 
the second try. Good job, <laughs> you know, that's I was trying to like while I was looking at you, I was like massively calculating in my head. So, I hey. knew he'd get it. All right. Uh, yeah. All right. Boy, thank you. Yeah. No, thank you, man. Thank you so much yeah. for your time. Thanks for Cheers. Uh, thanks for the interview. Yeah, absolutely. And tonight's going to be freaking amazing. I'm so Can't stoked. Wait. Can't wait. I'm oh, super yeah. stoked. Yeah. <laughs> this is Guri. I'm here with Jeff Loomis, Gothic Theater, Denver, Colorado. Rock on.